up attackers we're up here in Wrightwood sort of kind of I guess uh, we're gonna do some hiking with the uh, puppers today out here on a trail walking huskies uh, well they are sled dogs for a reason my arm is tired we haven't even started really nice uh, 80 something degrees a lot better than Phoenix where I normally reside and uh, yeah see anything cool we'll uh, keep you updated well guys without fail like two seconds later we come to this cool looking gorge canyon thing it's got a view out into the Mojave Desert and some mountains because you know we're not in Kansas and there's mountains I got I got ace on my leash and Jackie's with mom over there and uh, yeah we're climbing like straight up a hill because we're dumb or something I'm not really sure what the idea here was but uh, yeah lots of good views we're off of uh, Highway 2 in the Los Angeles County area, uh, just west of Wrightwood, and uh, climbing up some random road of some kind with the Husky recon vehicle waiting for us at the end of this thing. Imagine kids with really bad ADHD, that's pretty much these dogs today. And eating stuff off the ground and, you know, straight uphill and yeah. Just disclaimer, sorry, the camera work sucks. Uh, kinda new this whole vlogging thing. Um, new camera, not quite used to white balance and all that stuff yet. But uh, yeah, having a good time, getting some work in. Another update, giant bugs, oh god. So you might have to come rescue us. Giant bugs, we're getting bear attacked by giant bugs. Again, apologize I can't articulate with my hands, so I'm just bobbing my head a lot. But uh, I do have a husky attached to my free hand, so. But yes, bugs everywhere. Observe. It's nice and pretty and kind of deserty, but kind of foresty all at the same time. It's a hybrid landscape and dogs. Hey, look he sat. Look at you, dog. Good dog. Hi, Jackie. Yeah, Jackie's not very friendly for the camera, but Ace. Look at Ace. Acey. Aha. But yes. Oh, look at that. Resting dog face. Oh, nice breeze. That's another new thing. We're getting some kind of weird ocean desert breeze thing going on. Feels great. I'm a sweaty back. Yes. Bear, panda bears do sweat. And so do dogs. No, that's why they pant. Ha <laughs> ha! Fun fact for the mom. Dogs pant. They don't sweat. Science. Fun fact. If you didn't know, walking huskies is a massive pain in the butt. They like to follow lizards and squirrels. Oh my god, don't even get me started on squirrels. It's, it's literally like, what's the dog's name from Up? Doug? Doug from Up. He sees a squirrel, he's like, squirrel! It's literally like that. So, yeah. If you have a husky and you're trying to hike with it, just be prepared to uh, have numb shoulders and arms and uh, any other expenditures that you may possess or may not possess. Although, if you have a husky, I hope you have all four limbs because, hey, he laid down. Look at that fella. I think he's, t you think he's tired? Might be tired. And then there's Jack. Not never, tired. Never tired. Not tired. I'm Jack the Wonder Dog. But yeah, if you're wondering, Jackie is uh, only part husky. That's why he has the weird coloring. He's also some kind of Korean dog, we think, named Jindu. Thus, he's smart and full of energy. Great. And then there's this guy, Ace. Hi, buddy. He's like, I'm just going to lay here for a while. And let the bugs annoy me. It's a giant bug attack me. Murder hornets. <laughs> Murder hornets! Everywhere. Seriously, you can probably see them on camera if I can follow one closely. Although, I'm doing this with one hand, so it's kind of difficult. Hopefully on this channel, uh, you know, Bear Attack YouTube. And if you haven't, we have the podcast on Spotify, Apple Music, etc. Uh, you can help us on uh, Anchor.fm. You can, if you want to help our travel budget. Uh, this travel budget is free because I'm with my mom, but... Uh, me and the uh, two other bears would like to go do stuff. So, yeah, anchor.fm, you can fund us there. Uh, we're not quite into Patreon and stuff yet, but uh, hopefully we get there eventually. Still going up. Not as much, though. Hopefully we're getting close to the top. We're kind of in trees now, so that's wonderful. I love trees. But not to the point where I hug them. So don't get any ideas. I just like trees. They create good, clean air. I can breathe. Other than the altitude. That's kind of killing me right now because I live in that oven that is Phoenix. For those of you wondering... We were walking along this, I guess it's a fire road. It's 3N26.2. I don't know what the point two is for, but. Second mile. So, oh God, 
<laughs> a mile two accomplishment. But yeah, apologize if there's any kind of weird wind noise. I don't have a dead cat for the camera yet. And the dogs would attack the dead cat anyway. Hey, look, a view. Very nice. It's kind of, you know, it's got that Southern California smog. Um, the brown cloud, as we like to call it. Although that's the wrong side for the brown cloud, so it's just cloudy. For those of you that don't know, the LA side of the San Gabriel Mountains are have the brown cloud. On a clear day, you might be able to see the ocean in downtown from up here. Downtown LA, that is. Hey, look, another sign. Boy Scout Trail, Jackson Lake, miles, 3.7. Keep climbing or um, we're probably gonna just go that way but yeah dogs are panting we're sweating and uh exercise yay anyway water break time look at ace just dying and then jack's like please share please share i'm dying please share move your fat head uh -huh. ace is not sharing he's just downing it and then he's gonna throw up on my shoe because that's how he is Anyway, look, trees, yay, trees. Lots and lots of trees. I like nature. Um, if I could live in the mountains, I could, but my job is in the middle of the oven of the universe, so yay for that. And now it's Jackie's turn for water. If he will actually drink it, we'll see. Ace is like, oh, my water. Look, he's pulling me. Acey, hi, bud. And Jack just going to town on his water. Must not be contaminated, they drank it. We have no idea where this water bottle came from. It was in our fridge. But she's sniffing it and hopefully it isn't too bad. But this is my zen. This is what this is. Being pulled by huskies down trails. That's my zen when I'm not at work. And uh, yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Ace is like, please give me more water, please. It's flattened out a bit and we've changed directions. So now the wind is in our face and it feels great. For those of you that have never been to Southern California and you just know about the weather, it's not always this nice, especially where we live. It's probably 110 down there right now. It's nice, probably 83, 84 degrees up here with a breeze. Definitely, I don't know if it's coming from the ocean or not because there's a giant mountain right there, but there is a breeze. You can probably hear it in the trees. And it feels like Flagstaff, honestly. It's nice. For those of you that have never been to Arizona, and you think that's all desert? No, there's this one little isolated plateau thing that has trees and it snows on. So yeah, if you go to Arizona and you're expecting desert and you go to Flagstaff, you're not gonna find it. Things took a turn. Uh, we're kind of on the uh, secret shortcut, like that book where the kids have to go to school and then they get eaten by alligators or whatever. Um, yeah, we're on a single track on the side of a hill now. Great view of the mountain though. And a giant drop off right here. Even the trees can't withstand that. Um, yeah, so if we die, <laughs> you'll be the first to know. Look at the size of these sucking pine cones. Bigger ones, but I... These are big pine cones. I what? If we get hungry, because we're lost out here. Are pine cones edible? Million dollar question of today's vlog. The only other thing we have is dog bones. Scooby snacks! <laughs> Raggy! Anyway, enough of my terrible voiceovers. We are still climbing. In fact, that's going to be the story of this journey. Climbing up a hill unintentionally, as usual. This is usually what happens with us. Nothing new. Would you like to update them on what just happened? Help us. Help us. <laughs> we, uh, well, what happened is, you see, look, even the dog's tired. Woo! Good lord. What happened was, we found this trail that goes from like California to Canada, obviously, and Mexico. It goes all the way along. Pacific Coast Trail. Pa the, the, the words. Pacific Coast Trail, yes, that's what it's called. Um, and yeah, it usually connects to these little tiny trails that we do. But then we realized we must have somehow gone over the road that doesn't have a tunnel anywhere. Real, real confusing. Isn't it, dog? Yes, he agrees. It's confusing. Anyway. We'll update you after we're done massacring ourselves up this hill. Look how bad this is. Oh god, this is terrible. Coming down, not so bad. Coming up, like scaling the freaking Eiffel Tower. But, we are bears. We like nature. Going uphill kind of sucks, but we'll get over it. And there's coffee at the end of this light tunnel, so yes. Coffee runs lives. Just so you know. This is Bundaberg. This is ginger beer. It says it's from Australia. It's actually better warm, which is 
interesting. We're gonna head and get some coffee at the place called the Village Grind now up in Wrightwood. So yeah, hike over. And uh, dogs tired, people tired, sweaty, but not so buggy anymore. But uh, yeah, and if uh, you want to do the access road we did, it's across uh, Highway 2 from Vincent Gap, I believe it's called. Gulch. Vincent Gulch. There's a bunch of trails in this general vicinity, and uh, they're all fairly good, so yeah. This is what we're dealing with, the village grind. It's coffee, and it says wine cellar, but it's mostly coffee. So we're just gonna go with that for the time being. Got our coffee now. What the, what the, uh, she's like beating the dog's face with coffee, ah. <laughs> um, she's got the Almond Joy, pretty good. A um, little bit too coconutty for my taste, but uh, I'm gonna sound like a total hypocrite when I show you what I got. I got a Mounds Bar, <laughs> which is exactly the same thing as what she has, minus the almond. And the barista was trying to figure out what the difference was, and then she realized she didn't put any almond in yours, so she had to take the lid off and put almond in it. <laughs> and then there's this little doozy here. It is a Ken O H two O. This coffee's really good. We're sweaty, and uh, now we have to go do errands and stuff. So boohoo. Anyway. Listen to the podcast, Spotify, Apple Music, Bear Attack on Fa Bear Attack Show on Facebook. So if you're seeing this, follow the links to everything else. If you want to support our travel budget, Anchor.fm, our wonderful sponsor who allows us to distribute the podcast on all our platforms and all that stuff. Anyway, I'm Sam Oceans, I'm Panda Bear, and uh, thanks for joining us on this adventure. If you would like to see more videos like this, just stay tuned. We are got things in the works. Bear Attack!